focus on me? Baby, can you focus? Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. All right, so I've been asked for this tutorial, so let's go ahead and show you how to do it. So first, you want to start for the picture. You go on Pixar and go on Draw, cause we're finna fix the background. So on Pixar, you can hold the uh, background and it like creates the same color of the background. Just smooth it out, fix it out. This is like a little sample picture. That's why I'm like really rushing through it. So really, in this picture, it wasn't needed, but I just wanted to make it look as professional like somebody took it professionally so i just went in the background smoothed it out like try to blend the colors real good but if you don't the color the filter will do it by itself so you don't have to worry about that so right now i'm doing the shadow for the background so i'm just aligning that as you can see now you want to go into tools so you pick this one and then you kind of like play with the filters a little bit to see how you want it to look so think about it as like a professional picture like play with the filters to make it look as professional as you want it to look this is how like i did mine you can copy your screenshot like the numbers or whatever but this is how i did it all right that probably was the hardest part out of this whole tutorial now you just have to add the filters which are pretty easy you just play with it all right so now you go to fs effects fx effects and then you click fx and then go to noise this gives it the more like a uh, professional look like it just makes it look more natural i guess so kind of play with the you know filter on it to see how you want it to be and as you can see like the filters are um, kind of smooth out the background naturally so you really don't have to too much worry about it if you're not that good at like fixing the background and this is what you get like once you do everything now you want to click the simple tab and go all the way down to you can find twilight the filter this is the filter that gives it like that circular shadowed out and then you play with the filter a little bit to see how you like it let's see how dark you want it as you can see go into adjust then you go back in and you kind of play with the filters to give it more definition or to make it look brighter or darker depending on how your picture looks or what you know what kind of hairstyle you have and then that will pretty much be it for this part so now you're going to go back and draw and kind of add the highlights to the hair to the top of the hair of course and like some of the highlights is already in the hair so you can see right here i'm just adding the highlights but i'm going to fix it up of course and for the highlights you're just going to tap the background hold it kind of uh lower the opacity and like the hardness of it and this is what you should get for your end result 